Hey everyone, uh, measuring grape, the delicious snack that's also a wonderful form of measuring. And today we're going to be doing a Fiverr McDiver, that's correct. Isn't. Steve! Steve! What happened? What did you do? This is not a friend, she's dead! I, no, Steve, she's dead! What did you do last night? Where are we? Did we buy a house? Again? Oh shit, she got any ID? Oh, she's a caravanner. I'm gonna take her money though. And a police baton. Well, I don't- I don't know. Say she tripped. No one's gonna- Alright, she tried to shoot us and it ricocheted and killed her. Is that good? Okay, alright, alright, just- just leave her here. Oh, sorry, sorry Steve. Um, so, yeah, um, everyone, we're doing a Fiverr McDiver, um, sorry, Steve, and, uh, we're gonna be checking out a few awesome mods, let's take a look at them real quick, we're gonna be checking out, um, Run a Shop, that's right, Run a Shop, where we get to run our very own shop, we're gonna be checking out Al Chesbreach Museum, oh, <gasps> Steve, we gotta go to the museum today and show every, yeah, I know, I'm excited too, it's gonna be great, and we've also got Boathouse, and this is, I suppose this is what we're in right now at the moment, um, we're also gonna be checking out uh, th 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 the Fakuhar rifle, Fakuhar hill rifle, and the Hyena Infra Dead. That's right. So we've got a whole bunch of things. So let me. I'm. I'm just gonna read the news, and we can. We can get out of here. Um. All right. Let's. United Nations disbanded. Again, by Dorothy Proud, Capitol Post staff writer in a crushing blow to the foreign relations and world peace, the United Nations yesterday was completely disbanded, leaving its member nations to fend for themselves in these trying times. Many had considered the United Nations the best hope for brokering a ceasefire between the European Commonwealth and the nations of the Middle East, but... Wait, the Middle East. But such an intervention is now impossible. In a somber press conference at the United Nations building, Sakujimami Okaris had this to say... Ah, it is a sad day for U.S., sadder still for the world. An era of relative peace and prosperity has come to a tragic end. The resource wars are upon us, and, in my humble opinion, the United Nations is now more than needed now more than ever. Sadly, uh, the, uh, the, the world disagrees. Those nations that have not already moved out of the Im immense headquarters will have completely vacated the premise by the end of the week. Several organizations have already begun biding on the prime real estate, but children's toys retailer Bumbleos seems determined to transform the building into their new East Coast superstore. Ooh, nice. Yeah, another story about some guy who kills people. Boring. I've heard it all before. So, this is, in fact, a boathouse. This is pretty cool. I do like this uh, really nice little house. You got your fridge, you got all the amenities, and it's, it's very cramped, though, so if you have any companions, uh, they should stay outside. I'm just going to get it real... Um, not a lot of pooping, though. You have to poop off the side. So, Steve, you... Well, I guess... All right, open the windows. We'll air it out. So yeah, uh, this is the outside. We've got a little radio there. That's uh, they didn't, they didn't tell me about that when they. All right, whatever, fine. Um, yeah, this is the outside. Pretty nice little, uh, pretty fancy. Like I said, a little cramped, but I mean, it's a, uh, it's an actually, it's a really nice player home. I really enjoy how it's set up. You got your little plants up here, and you got your sweet solar panels, and it's a really nice, cozy home and very lore friendly. Whoops. Well, we're polluting today already. We've uh, accomplished that at least. So, yeah, uh, pretty cool. Let's, uh, let's head on to our weapons before I forget. Um, first one is the Fakuhar Hill Rifle. Um, I believe this is a custom mesh, but I'm not completely sure. Farkuhar. I forgot to write, I didn't write an R when I wrote, okay. It's the Farkuhar Hill Rifle, and still, I don't understand what that means. Anyhow, custom mesh, custom texture, I do believe, but maybe not. I don't care. Uh, it looks really cool. Good stuff. Got a huge little, uh, magazine there, and, uh, Pretty sexy looking, not gonna lie. Damage 51, DPS 138, and it takes 308 ammunition. Oh my lordy. Um, so yeah, cool, good stuff. Uh, next up, we got the Hyena Infra Dead. This is, uh, I didn't realize this when we first got it, this is a NIF scope weapon, and this basically uses um, uh, 
giant explosives. It uses its own kind of ammunition, which is a 50.50 .50 BMG infused E115. I'm sure that's some sort of something, but it basically shoots nukes. Um, like I said, NIF scope weapon. So it uses already uh, all the stuff, and that's already in the game. And uh, pretty cool. I do. I really do like this. Um, only gripe is it's kind of blue for some reason. The stock is blue, which kind of it's just weird. I don't know why it's blue. That's the only thing that kind of off put me for a little woozy. That might I don't know. That might be something with my game, but I think that's just the way it looks, which is kind of weird. But besides that, uh, I really do like this. Got a laser scope and all these little doodads. Sticking out of it, good stuff, and it's really good for catching fish. It's really so. Let's. Oh nope! All right, I fell. What are you guys doing? Are you playing with the hobos? Steve, how many hobos? Jesus, dude! Come on! I I. Oh, there's another one. Oh. Oh. And I crashed the game. <laughs> So, yeah, totally crashed my game. Uh, I guess I'll shoot. There we go. Happy birthday, everyone. So, yeah, this basically shoots nukes. Um, so it's a, it's a pretty cool weapon, but it's, uh, it's pretty godly. And you gotta be careful what you're shooting at, because you will murder everything in existence. Yeah, there we go. Pots and plans. Picnic's canceled, boys and girls. Oh, God. Wow. All right. Secondary explosives are going on. Someone's angry. Oh, it's Cuddles. He's angry. All right. So, uh, we do, in fact, we have a, um, we've got a museum to open today. We've got a ribbon cut cutting ceremony. So, we, we better get on that. Jerry's ready. Steve's ready. Janet. You're, all right. That's a hobo. Hobo. Do you know where Janet is? Yeah, there's a bunch of dirty hobos in the water, Steve. I'm not just going to be jumping in the water like it's nothing. <sighs> Where is she? Janet. 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 Where are you? Where Where is she? <clears throat> really? She's just gone? Because she's a bitch? All right. Great, great. You know what, Janet? That's fine. You enjoy the boat. You enjoy the stinky hobos. That's great. That's fine. Um, I also wanted to take a look at the um, the shotgun from the deterrent last week. Uh, I just wanted to put this in there just because I thought it was a cool gun. We didn't really get to take a look at it. Um, this was uh, a, a custom mess from someone. They uh, someone made it and then they put it in the deterrent. I, I don't. I, I'm pretty sure it was a separate mod, but I, I'm not completely sure. Um, it's the double pump. It's a pretty cool weapon. Uh, it just looks really nice in uh, first person. Just a very sleek, sexy weapon. I, I, I enjoy it very much. Uh, it's going to be very good. It's, it's good. It's good. So let's head to our uh, museum. This is a brand new museum. They just opened it in Prim for us. Um, we've, we've saved Prim a number of times. And, and they, they, they wanted to pay justice. They wanted to say, hey you've done so well and we really appreciate it so we're gonna head on over there there's, apparently there's a cutting of the ribbon a few pictures will be taken with me and the and the boys uh it was gonna be the gang but janet didn't want to come apparently because you know she's doing lady things or something whatever oh shit it's, what time is it 7 30 what is this a, a late night this is the place this is the place. Steve, where are you? Steve. Steve, I know you're here. All right, listen. Steve, you can hear me. You leased them this building. You couldn't have spruced it up for them? You know, not, you know how much money we have? Oh, my God. There's there's oil bottles on the ground, Steve. Did they? Uh, they must have opened it already. Come on, let's go. All right, uh, I guess we missed the opening. Oh, God, I am... We definitely missed the opening. Shit. Something's going on with the floor. Steve, did you talk... Who did you talk to? I don't know who you... The guy over there? Excuse me, sir. Hi, I'm, um... Um... Uh, I'm... I'm, I'm Albert Breach. Uh, this is... I was... Yes, I'm, I'm telling him now. I was here for the uh, ribbon cutting. Yeah? No? 
Yeah? Sir? And the game crashed. Yep. It's gonna be one of those days. Excuse me, sir. I, I apologize that the world collapsed. Where did, where did they go? Oh, come on. Excuse me, sir. Hi. Yes, I'm, I'm Hal Chatsbreach. Who, who are you? You should look on the other side of the room. Then you should be able to figure out your answer. Oh, okay, what do you have for sale? This is what I have available. Okay. Okay, thank you. Sir, I don't need any of these things. This is a museum, sir. Do you have a permit? I'm taking this. Unbelievable. The other side of the room? Door to museum. Oh, it's not even the... The anti al Breach Society. Steve, did you... Did you lease an anti... Oh, come on! We don't need the money! Jesus Christ, Steve. Hey. Hi. Ma'am? Yeah, this is a museum. What are you... What happened to your eye? Let's just say that I was affixing a gun that I accidentally hit myself in the eye. Shut up. I know it's embarrassing. Could have just lied to me, you know? Bye. S sir? What do you need? Uh, um, uh, okay. Bye. Yeah, whatever. What do you... Who are you? I don't need anything. Later. Uh, oh, God. Yo, Paley McCream face. Got some uh, mayonnaise everywhere. What do you need? Nothing. Bye. Steve, this is a flea market. This is, I wanted a, a, a museum with shining lights. What, what is that? Uh, is there a science fair? Steve, look, I, I, I'm not that self-centered, but... But there, there should be an old lady selling, like, knickknacks and such. Oh, God. All right, let's just go in the museum. I don't even want to go in there. Come on, let's go. So Steve arranged most of most of this for uh, for our consumption. He leased out. He he put some uh, money. Yes, I know. I'm explaining it now. He put some money up for the building. Uh, he met with a few uh, interested people who wanted to put up a museum. I, I didn't really want to have the museum built because I, I it, it makes me feel a little goofy, a little self-centered. Uh, activate ball. Who? Oh, this is embarrassing. Did you not tell them, Steve? He's back in time. Don't you walk away. This is an exact replica of Al Chesbreach's compa companion, Captain Ballarms. He has a tendency of smashing into things. Looks about right. The ass does check out. Okay. Steve. Okay, yes. Quit showing off your quantum physics. <sighs> what is this? Verta what? This is one of the many Verta birds that Al Chesbreach flew. This is the very one of the many that he has crashed. Keep in mind that it is still volatile. Steve, this is a lie. Steve, who's gonna fly this vertebrate? Who is this for, ants? Oh my god, Steve. Steve, you can't give, you, you gave the proprietor a fake vertebrate and said it was the real thing. Do you have any idea how large that ship was? <sighs> Don't give me none of that shrink ray crap. A shovel, okay, this one works, this one works. Why the shovel? Not just any ordinary shovel. This was the exact shovel used to kill elite Brahmin herders that worked for Osama or Osama bin Brahmin. Okay. Right. See, see, Steve, this one's a good one. This one was a good one. See, we got the shovel in there. It works. Steve, can you... Steve, Steve, and also, did you use the quantum mechanic machine on the floor? Steve, there are particles intersecting. This whole place could explode any moment. All right, I, I, I guess we'll go check out the anti chest breach. I'm sure they'll have more exhibits. Fucking flea market, Steve. Flea market. Come on. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Get away from me. It's not funny. It's mean. I'm going to burn that place. I'm going to burn that place. It's stupid flea market drunkie. No. No. It's eight. What do you mean a restaurant? 
Oh, shit, the restaurant. Oh, we gotta start the restaurant. Okay, all right, we're, we're gonna head on over to the restaurant. Um, uh, J Jimmy, can you can you tell the folks about what the restaurant's going on? Uh, we're, we're gonna walk there. Take it out. Take it away, Jimmy. Thanks for the handoff, Johnny. Here's what it happens when you load your game up. This is exactly the thing that's gonna pop up. It says, you're the new shop owner has loaded. You hear rumors that an old man named Pete is selling his store in Freeside. Maybe you should check it out. He can be found in the Atomic Wrangler. By the way, customers come every day, unless doors locked, anytime between 9 a.m. and 1 p.m. Upgrades can now be purchased, as well as guards, employees, turrets, and stock. There are also more customers, exclamation point. We hope you enjoy the mod and please Please vote endorse if you like. Really, phone. Really. Okay, I, I apologize, Jimmy. I I did not expect. Sweet Christ. Uh, this mod's from Kalazaka and Spartan Killer eight nine seven. Back to you, Jimmy. Thanks, Jimmy. Much appreciated. All right, everyone. So we're in Freeside here, where we can uh, get our store from the Atomic Wrangler. We're gonna head on over there. Maybe make me. No. Maybe we can make a deal. Oh my God! I hate these people so much. I think that's the store. It, lo it looks pretty nice. I like it. We're going to spruce it up. We're going to make it real nice. Real classy thing. It's going to be good. Got high hopes for my dreams to be to be a restaurant entrepreneur. You must have some real no. with house to get inside the lucky 38. Okay, I don't know which guy it is. Is it this guy? This guy looks like a drunk. Hi, Pete. Hello there. My name is Pete. And I was wondering if you would like to invest in something. Why are you wearing a hat and then... And then the... Uh, sh Den Pens. What's the investment, Den Pens? It's a store, my friend. I'll sell it to you for 5,000 caps. It's a steal. Yeah, I can't really hear you. If you could speak up a lot, that'd be great. No thanks, I'm not interested. 5,000 caps? The place is just a financial burden to you. I save you some money and, and buy it for 3,000 caps. Okay, I'll take it. I'm sorry, I just don't have that kind of caps. 5,000? Make it 3,000. Well, you do look like a businessman. And you do have a point. No one else is in line to buy it, so... Okay. 3,000 caps it is. You're damn right. No thanks, I'm not interested, by the way. <laughs> so that's a problem, that I can say that again. Goodbye. Can I keep saying that to you? Hey. I'm fine. Yeah, okay. I can just keep saying that. Alright. Kind of weird. Um, the Rangers sweet. Are getting reinforced. So... If I were a store, where would I be? Is this dickhole not going to tell me where the store is? And give me a note? Anything? No. Okay. Really? You're not going to say anything? I mean, I, I know the pictures are on the Nexus page. Lasers, plasma, pistols, grenades. Sweet hot dogs and a hand job. Where is this place? Oh dear, you make furious. Pete, you are making me furious and I don't know. Oh, is that it? No, those are. Oh wait, maybe that is. That's it. Okay, is that. This is literally the worst place a store could be. We are not going to make any business. Especially with that novelty tent store. Ugh. Over here. Oh god. Yeah, shot Cuddlesworth. <laughs> and that's the only time I'll be using my weapon this entire mod review. Damn, that is a huge sign. I'm afraid that's going to fall on someone. Well, let's see what we can do. Use key. Activate store options. Open up shop. Close the store. What time is it? 6.29. No one's coming. Let's go inside, boys. Check out our brand new store. Janet's going to be jealous when she finally gets here and she realizes that she's been missing out this whole time. Vault Tech. Revolutionizing safety. I like it. What do you guys think? It's good? I think it's good. We got to get a few more uh, things in stock, but besides that, I, th I think it should be fine. <laughs> 